What's up, Internet? Today we're going to be reviewing the Bug Assault Shotgun, a gun meant to replace your fly swatter and make hunting household flies a lot more fun. So let's get into it. Basically, this is your gun. And when you order it, you'll receive this packaging. It tells you all about it right here. It tells you all about it on the back. If you've been to their website, you've seen this. Um, they have pictures of it everywhere. Uh, they have some pros listed right here, which I wanted to cover. Uh, use ordinary table salt. So anything that you pick up at the grocery store, anything that you're going to have in your pantry, will go right in there. Not that uh, fancy rock salt. Don't use that. That's not going to work. No batteries required. Completely pump action. Uh, 50 shots per little reload here. Pop-up sight. You'll see that in a second when we go over how it works. Uh, will not splatter a fly, which is one of the biggest pros to me because when I smack a fly with my fly swatter and the guts kind of go all over, all over the table, um, just then I got to go get like a napkin and clean it up. That's a huge pro to me. Um, and obviously the slide pumping cocking, which you just saw I shot it. So how does the gun work? Basically what you do is you get some salt and you got the little chamber right here you pop that open and you fill it with your salt and that goes about that deep into the gun so it can hold quite a bit 50 shots worth if you know you're wanting to be exact and uh, you find your fly you lock in on them and you get ready to shoot however after pumping no matter how much you pull the trigger, you're not going to be able to shoot. Okay? This is one of those safety mechanisms meant for, you know, accidentally shooting people in the face or something. Um, once you pump it, this is going to pop up. You got your little sight right here. And if you don't pump it, this is not up. This is just, you know, a clear indicator that the gun is ready to go. So you got your fly, you got your sight. You need to do one more thing. There is a safety switch over here. What you're going to do is you're going to flip this safety switch back. And then you're going to shoot. Okay. It has some power behind it. Not enough to obviously hurt me or anything like that. It's just a slight sting. And it shoots out, you know, just a tiny bit, just a pinch of salt. And you kill your fly. Move the carcass and move on with life. So, um, obviously we covered some of the pros that they had listed on the box over there. Um, one of the things that is just hard to mention is how much fun this gun is. There is, it's so much fun just to, you know, find your fly and hunt it. You know, if you're into hunting, if you're into the, you know, the video game culture, this product's going to be more for you. Um, I don't really want to say men. I feel like it's more geared towards men. But some of my female friends have had a lot of fun with this gun. Um, what I've actually found is it takes more time to kill a fly with this gun. And not because of any, you know, lacking product feature. It's because I like to hunt the fly. If I see a fly, and I, I think most people will agree with me on this. If you see a fly when using this gun, you don't want to just grab your gun and kill it right away. You want to give it a chance to get away. You want to have a little fun with it. So this makes killing flies a lot more fun. However, you know, at the con of it takes a little bit more time than just smacking it with a fly swatter because you want to have fun with it. And it does. They, they succeeded so well in just making hunting flies so much fun. And, uh, yeah, I just, I highly recommend it. It's, it's a lot of fun to hunt flies with this. Um... I've used it on other bugs. I've used it on, you know, just little spiders and whatnot that's crawling around that doesn't, like, limit itself to flies. Um, the biggest con, though, the biggest con to this gun, I think probably the only con I have to this gun, is that, you know, when using it, your, your apartment or your house, I live in an apartment, is going to be just rained and covered with salt. So, that's one of the, the biggest cleanups. You don't just have to move the fly, but 
you know, you got to wipe up the salt that just came up, came out of the gun and killed the fly. It's not a lot, obviously. Um, when you shoot it, it kind of just, let's see if we can get it on camera here. Kind of sprays. If you're at a distance, it sprays everywhere. So the, the little pieces of salt, you know, might get lost, you know, within your carpet or whatever you use. And you might not notice it. But if you're shooting at a desk or something, you know, you're going to have salt all over the place and that can get kind of tricky to clean up. So just keep that in mind if you're looking at buying this gun. Obviously, you're going to know that because it is a salt gun and it shoots salt. So, I mean, that's what it's designed for and it's not really a complaint towards that. I still gladly use it because it's just so much fun. <clears throat> um... I believe that's all I have to say about it. Again, I highly recommend purchasing one. It is just a blast. Um, they market it towards adults, 18 and plus, obviously. Um, if you have any questions, you know, drop us a line. We'll give you a fair, objective answer, as always. Remember to follow us on Twitter, uh, like us on Facebook, follow, subscribe to us on YouTube, and all that. We're going to have more product reviews from uh, independent product creators. And until next time.